man. When it rains, it pours. When it rains, it pours. So T.I. and Tiny, like I said, months ago, this came out. This, this, this girlfriend that they had, this home girl, wanted to go to war, fell out with T.I. and, you know, got all these girls together and they started just unraveling all of this shit, just exploiting everything. Uh, like I said, for years, it was always rumors T.I. and Tiny was freaks. You know, you could see videos, clips, and pictures online of them, you know, naked with girls and shit like that. So I knew that part. I wasn't surprised by that part. But today, Tyrone Blackburn, the black lawyer who's representing all these chicks, uh, said that there's a male accuser now. There is a man out of 11 alleged victims that he's representing. Now, it's over 20, 30-something girls at this point. But Tyrone Blackburn is representing 11 of these females 11 people, and out of 11, 10 of them are women. Now there's a man. Uh, and of course, out of, you know, the man has yet to uh, be, the details have yet to be revealed. Uh, they, 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 they gonna, they gonna keep this one in the holster and make us wait for this fully loaded clip. They, they not gonna just let us, they, just, they gonna drag this out. Huh? What are they? Just for the conversations like this, so we can sit around and, you know, try to come up with scenarios. Man, what? I know T.I. from Atlanta, but damn. <laughs> they are saying that a guy is now accusing T.I. and Tiny. And I'm like, whoa. You know, now this makes the story, this this puts a whole another twist on this story now. You know, now uh, you got the one woman that came forward from 2005, uh, from the LAPD's involved, because in the LA All-Star game from 2005, that was when a girl had accused them and said that, you know, she T.I. and Tiny made them drink the Molly water. Which that's what seemed like every girl said in a note. Uh, and the girl claimed that she met them at a Hollywood nightclub. They invited her to the hotel. Like I say, by invitation. No one put a gun to your head and said, come to the, to the bar. Come to the house. I mean, come to the hotel room. Let's get naked and get nasty. You decided to go. You know? Uh, so T.I. and Tiny asked them to come to the bed and rub oil on. You know, the, the, this is what the girl says. She's naming her. She's calling herself Jane Doe. She says, T.I. asked her to come to the bed and rub oil on his body. <laughs> rub, rub kiwi juice or whatever the fuck on his body. This nigga think he LL Cool J or some shit. So he says he wants her to rub oil on his body. And T Tiny joined while they watched a porn in the background. And the woman says, T.I. stuck his toes in her vagina without warning. <laughs> what the fuck? T.I. a little nasty motherfucker, man. He's, this, this is the type of shit he's into. Look, people sexually kinky, got all kind of freaky kinks. I, I'm, the people are wild out here, man. Wild. i never forget I had an old white guy ask me straight up broad daylight if I could screw his wife. People are fucking freaks. And that does not exempt celebrities that you grow up idolizing either. People watched SWV Escape versus Escape, and they said in the comment section, Tiny doing all of this is so she could go to jail in a couple of months. But as I continue, T.I. stuck his toes in this girl's vagina without warning her. Just poop, just regular, you know, regular fucking uh, windmill kicking the pussy. Then she started to feel sick and went to the bathroom to vomit. God damn, he kicked her that hard? Then Doe says she doesn't remember any of the details of that night, but claims to have woke up with a sore vagina. Gee, come on, T.I. Police are still investigating T.I.'s lawyer's claims that they have yet to be contacted about the matter. Another woman reported T.I. for sexual assault in Vegas. However, the department closed the case because of the alleged crime happened past the statute of limitations. Well, Vegas prostitution's legal, so Vegas, you know, you know that's why they say anything you get away with in Vegas. Uh, but he doesn't seem to be concerned. T.I. was hanging out with uh, Soldier Boy in the Rick recording studio the other day. Uh, I guess him and Soldier Boy are gonna put out some 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 crazy record. I mean, I don't know what the hell you're doing working with Soldier Boy, who hasn't been relevant in years. And it's, what, 10 years, you're minor. But, you know, T.I. can do what he want to do. But, yeah, this is this is now a plot twist now. They, they done dragged a man into this. And they going to fucking drag this out and make us wait for the the, the, the details of that. I don't even think I want to know the details of, the, of that. I, you know, I really don't want to know. Because if T.I. is putting his toes in girls' his pussy, and, I mean, it's not like he just eased it in or said come on baby let me do something different that nigga just cool he just kicked her right in the pussy you know what i mean kicked her in the pussy this shit this is what she, this is alleged you know some of these girls they could make up some wild stories but that's the one consistent story that i, I keep seeing molly water 
Molly Water and Molly Water. And when you look at the fact that these two have been caught with Molly and meth possession, it, the shit adds up. You know what I mean? Y'all, I know a lot of people starting to really starting to people starting to turn their face now. A lot of people was like, "Man, this is all bullshit." Hey, psh, it's too many coincidences. I personally think it has something to do with his relationship with Lance Bottoms. Uh, I find it kind of odd that since this has been going on, Lance Bottoms has completely stepped away from all of the rappers she was chilling with, like Killer Mike and T.I. himself, you know, and Monica and all of them. Lance Bottoms did a press conference two weeks ago. She stepped down pretty much. She's not even going to reelect uh, later on this year to rerun for mayor of the city. You know, I, I think a lot of this had to do with his relationship with her also. But yeah, T.I. and Tiny... At this point, I guess they just like, you know what the hell, it is what it is. The world know that we freaks. But um, now it's really like 2021, 2021, especially with all this Kwame Brown shit. No, it's like this year is the year of, of, of exploitation, the year of exposure. All of the bullshit is being unraveled piece by piece, piece by piece by piece, man. Let me know what y'all think about this. There's now a man out here accusing T.I. and Tiny of uh, of sexual assault and T.I. apparently uh, likes to kick women in their vagina. <laughs>